Welcome back to a new video from Visual Art Classroom in Isai Calvani Secondary School. The second uh, work or assignment we can be asked for uh, about polygons and tangents is to draw uh, circles that are going to be tangent to every two sides uh, of the polygon and th that have uh, a specific radius. For example, imagine uh, the, the the question for these uh, activities: draw all the circles you can that are going to be tangent to every two sides of this uh, pentagon, and are going to be two centimeters or twenty millimeters radius, for example. Well, and the proxy, the general proxy, it's uh, so far the same as we did in a previous video, for example, you can see we uh, broke down the, the polygon into uh, five uh, as a sort of triangle, just working with the uh, angle bisectors on every vertex. This is the always the same, the same thing to do. But now uh, we have to keep in mind all those angle bisectors. So in this case, we have five angle bisectors. I'm going to get rid of the lines that are not uh, necessary any longer for the sake uh, of this explanation and the, 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 clear the cleanness of this explanation. Um, what what do, do we have to do is to draw a, a line perpendicular to any side in this case for example AB mm, so and, and measure on this line over this line, the radius we have been asked. So imagine we have already get uh, the 20 millimeters and I, I with the with the compass, and I draw this mark, and and afterwards I'm going to draw with a new color in order to distinguish it from this point, a line that is going to be parallel to side AB. So this distance is always 20 millimeters long and it intersects the two angle bisector corresponding to the uh, both vertices on the ends of uh, the segment, the side AB, to these two points. The two points are uh, part of the solution. If we wanted to, to, to keep uh, working the same way with the rest of the angle bisectors I already have, I should work new lines from these points that are going to be always, remember this is very important, to the corresponding sides uh, over the lines, I mean in this case CB and in this case for example AE. So this line is going to be parallel to AE on this line from this point I'm going to draw a new line that is going to be parallel to ED. So you can tell that we get on the whole a new polygon that is going to be smaller than the former one uh, but parallel. So all those points I'm going to work with a different color are going to be I'm going to of course outline them to make them stand out from the drawing. So all those points are uh, solutions. So let's keep going, for example, from this point I'm going to take, remember, this distance, 20 millimeters. So you need to start with your compass on it. So this is going to be the first solution. This is going to be second solution so let me work a little bit more accurately yes and this is going to be the third solution and of course the fourth and the last one is going to be over here yes 
this could be more or less uh, your final result so I hope the video has been helpful for, for you uh, so long